Allen's rib of beef, a fine piece of meat. I think a lot of the time when you buy rib of beef um, from your normal butcher, it's also got a, a lot of fat on it. So it's slightly daunting knowing how to cook it, how you sort of render down the fat. But Peter's selected and trimmed these in such a way before uh, they've gone into the Himalayan salt chamber, which is basically a wall of salt bricks in the fridge. The salt actually conditions the air, so you don't get that sort of rotten meat on the outside. And, you know, 99% of the beef is perfectly edible. Cooking this on the bone is really quite simple. It's not all you're cooking is pure meat here. And the bone is really uh, saving it from really shrinking too much. And what, what you can do after it's cooked is either remove the bones in one foul swoop like that, carve it and serve your guests the bones to sort of gnaw on afterwards. Or if you want to buy a cut of meat like this, you can actually make it into your own servings of uh, cop de boeuf or river beef. So if, you want, if you're tempted to buy a whole piece and a few of your dinner party guests don't turn up, just cut it in between the bones and use it for barbecuing or grilling like a normal cop de boeuf. So really by buying a piece of beef like this, you've got a couple of options.